This guy can barely walk. In fact, he has a tough time, but... Sounds too good. He's making it. Hi! Yeah, he got to be in his 95s. The yeah, Walter that I... Uh, Mulford right around the corner is 95 this year, I bet. Because I, he said he was 94 last year, so I'm thinking he could be 95 now. My tire's going flat, just as I suspected. I came out uh, this morning, yesterday morning. Came out, yeah, yesterday. Came out, jumped on my bike. Got Dennis's bike out of the way, unlocked him, got out of the way, and jumped on my bike, and bleh. In fact, the tire came half off the rim. And uh, <laughs> I wouldn't go nowhere. So I put it back on the rim. Figured maybe I can blow it up, see what happens. Blew it up, used it for that day, and they came out this morning and it was flat again. Oh, they're in there. Oh, the only did was. Oh, that's right, they cleaned it. Nice color. I like that gray. Nice and light. I think that's what uh, we have. got the same lawn as everybody else. Boom, 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 bang, boom, boom, ribbit, ribbit, dibbit, dibbit. Yeah, back and forth, back and forth. And uh, yeah, after a while it gets tiring, especially when I'm doubling the speed with my zero turn, where I might have been doing two or three, I'm doing probably four to five miles an hour while I'm mowing, but it goes to seven, and that's only full throttle on the tar, because it looks so shit when it goes that fast, especially on the lawns I have to mow, because they're all bumpy and, and yucky, mole holes, mole hills, yeah, there's some mole holes, so, and some divots from uh, animals digging in the yard for moles. Or skunks digging in there for something to eat? I don't know. Oh, my lawn in the back has got all kinds of skunk. Skunk stuff. Skunk holes. When it's sitting there, they just put their four, four paws right down there and dig a hole looking for some kind of, some kind of bug. <laughs> What's up? You overpaid me, so I think that was yeah, a freebie. All right, good. All right. Okay. I think I called you and let you know. Yeah. I don't know how. Yeah, how, how oh, okay. Oh, that goes right to your machine. Yeah. Okay. Did you do something right on the front? Did you do something right on the front at the top? Not yet. It looks very light. Well, we washed it. Oh. I washed the whole house. Oh, it looks real light. That's when it gets sun all day, yeah. probably, yeah. Well, I washed the whole house. I gotta put some clear on it. Some of the deck was rotted, so I just put it on. Yeah. 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 That and the bees eating the wood. On the deck, or? No, up on the peaks. On my peaks. Oh, yeah. That's why they like it, too. Going right through it. Going all the way up and down. That and woodpeckers. <laughs> really? Yeah. They love that cedar. They love it. You know, no paint on it. When, when, my, when my dad built the uh, garage, he just had the joists for the ceiling and stuff. And come time, I had a bird or two in there. And I said, fuck it, I'm going to put some quarter-inch shipboard up there. Kind of dragged the garage down a little bit. You can see it's hanging a little bit. But at the same time, 
get rid of the birds. I had birds in there. I had raccoon family one time or another right outside of the, fa the fascia. Oh, Jesus. But I still have birds now. Sharon says, don't mess with them, leave them, do whatever. Yeah. So they're only shitting on your car, Sharon. No, oh, I'll deal with it. Yeah. <laughs> birds are all right. Yeah. I don't mind birds, but the bees, they go right through the wood. The glowing bees, you know? They eat right through it. Oh, oh. That much? Oh, it's unbelievable. Whoa. Oh, my God. I How come you never saw that before? Oh, yeah, I saw it all. Oh, 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 they oh, come yeah. right back then. Is that what you're well, saying? Well, no, I, he just replaced them, so, I mean, I don't know. We'll see. But he put up two pieces of new wood on the back deck up on the, on the peak, and the frickin' bees were coming back to where the hole was. Trying, I said, the son of a bitch is going to do it again. Yeah, I yeah. killed one of them, but I just... <laughs> oh, they must have been coming... Bang, boom, boom, no, boom. Get them all over the big, place. Big, you know, those big, yeah. big bees. They, yeah. they go right through the woods. Holy They go cow. in and they take a right-hand turn. <laughs> lady told me that. And it's true. They do. They do. They go in about, and they take a right-hand turn. Hey, what, when you get the boards fixed, tell, tell me which way they went. Yeah, I could. I could cut open the thing and see. <laughs> see what's going on in there. Oh, that's funny. Yeah, but the guy we just, we just left. Yeah. Come back tomorrow to finish. I got this. And I got woodpeckers up in Yin Yang. They made holes this big all the way up and down my front door. Oh. Yeah, I need to go see the houses. They love them, boy. There's no pain. Oh, on. yeah, they're really easy to... <laughs> if you come up from Walmart on Gorman Road, yep. just before you come to the school, there's a, a pine tree looking right up at the right. It no, it's got bark on the top, maybe 12, 15 feet up, and bark on the bottom, and it's bare in the middle with about 40 peck oh, holes in it. Yeah. 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 <laughs> well, we'd be sitting, sleeping at night, and all of a sudden we'd hear them. They start. Oh, it's at night time. But finally, you know, and I, and I, I said, that's enough of this. I got up one morning with my skiddies on. I'm out in the freaking yard with my shotgun. I got him. Oh, did you? <laughs> I said, the hell with this bastard. I said, you ain't wrecking my house anymore. Yeah. Uh, but, you know, I see the shotgun about 7 o'clock in the morning. I think all of the neighbors are yeah. going to go nuts. Yeah, nothing. Yeah. What am I going to do? Are you yeah. ruining the house? Yeah. Jeez. Well, now you're going to have to put some kind of defectant up there so they don't well, come I back. I have to because it, I couldn't believe it. came right back to where his holes were. Wow. Three new boards up there. Wow. I got one of them with a broom, but I <laughs> yeah. the other one I missed. They're probably back and swarming around Paul's looking for something. Back tomorrow to finish that. It's <laughs> not close, so you know, there's got to be 200 of them over there going, ah, <laughs> damn. I don't know why, but they do it. We got them at the rock, too. I was sitting here serving food the other day, and all of a sudden I see sawdust falling there. Sure enough, going up in there. Oh, oh, yeah. You didn't know they were there, though? Nope. Or you, they're kind of out of the way. Yeah, they're kind of out of the way in the back yeah. there, too. Yeah. Damn. Yeah, they make a mess. <laughs> Oh, I got a woman shed. I'm, I'm not worried about that. No, no. <laughs> but I've had to fix paint houses. Oh. I've had to fix them for a Yeah. Them. Most of the time they're painted so you can fill them with anything. You know, I got clear so I can't just fill them. Yeah. Show sure. up. You know what I mean? Yeah, like, exactly. Oh, them, right. right, you can't do that. Uh, and I have uh, shakes. I have the groove shakes. Right. From 1958. Too, so, yeah. Oh, the paint I put on there last time was one yeah. thick paint. Yeah. And, Most uh, of the time they won't need food of paint. Yeah. No, we don't have any bug problem. All I have is ants and maybe a couple of little millipedes or whatever yeah. roaming around down in the cellar. But in, in, in those, you know, those, those airway things, you know, those on the back, I thought that's what the woodpecker was going at. You know, I think that's what oh, they were oh, yeah, trying yeah, to get yeah. at. Okay. You know, First they would start, they were pecking on the uh, gutter, and it would chase those bugs out from behind the gutter. Oh. Next thing I know, they're going through the fucking corner boards. Oh, that's, that's good. good. Oh, yeah. Pretty nasty. Yeah, I went and bought and seed up. I bought six boards yesterday, $150. Nuts. Now, why don't you get the, uh, was it polyethylene or oil? Resin board or something oh, like well, that? Oh, it's got to match the house. Oh. oh. So the board, you know what I mean? Oh. I just can't put anything up there. Oh. You know, they make Azac with the plastic. I could put that, you know, but I'm not painted it. It's clear. Oh, okay. I had to buy cedar. Oh. And I bought cedar with knots in it this time. No, really? <laughs> stuff I got on see, the house is no knots. Great to see, great. I wouldn't be able to afford that house today if you had to buy cedar for it. Not even close. Not even close.
that's crazy. Theater, I placed it out. One one ten foot board was uh, I think sixty nine dollars. Christ, my house would cost you a hundred grand just, just for the freaking wood. Yeah, hundred grand just for the cedar. Oh, yeah. Uh, <laughs> nuts. My son's looking at a house. Around here? Is he still? No, oh, up north. Looking at a 5,000 square foot fucking house. Looks like the fucking monster's house. Big fucking. I sit there. What the hell is wrong with you? I said, you're going to be working on it constantly. Oh, nothing in it? Nothing? He's got no, a lot of work to do? No, it's an old house. It's oh, okay. It's an 1800s. Oh. It's all falling apart. Wow. Does he want to do that? I'm trying guy? to talk him over out of it. Mm -hmm. If he wants to do that, does he know what to do? No. He's not handy. <laughs> he's not handy. He's no, he doesn't. He shouldn't. No way. And I told him, he says, he used to paint with me. He says, well, I can paint it. I says, yeah, it's going to take you five years to paint it. And I says, by then, then you're going to have to paint it again, I said. Yeah, yeah, yeah. you got to do the under underbelly stuff. Oh, yeah, it, it looks like a monster's house. It's three stories. It's 5,000 square feet, guys. Three stories? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what what, what is it, 10 by 10, 40 feet up or something? I don't know what the fuck he's thinking. It's unbelievable. Wow. Oh, well. Well, he paid nothing for it and figures he can handle it. Well, he hasn't bought it yet. I'm oh, oh. trying to talk oh, about it. Oh, he hasn't bought it yet. No, I thought you bought it. Now he's got to no, ask his dad he for just gotta, He just got to accept it for the loan. He said, no. I said, let me come look at it. I said, well, I said does it have insulation? Uh, Ooh, says, mo most likely it, not. And it doesn't. He says, it's not listed. I says, if it's not listed, there's no insulation. No, he doesn't know enough for what to look into. I had a house, the house I lived in in Putnam, when I did the one bedroom off to the south side, uh, there was another house next to us, so there wasn't much for the sun or whatever, but yeah. uh, I did that, there was nothing in the walls. Just, I took the horsehair off the wall, the yeah. horsehair plaster off the walls, and I uh, put in some insulation and some batting, yeah. and uh, nothing was in there. No, there's nothing in this one, I know. That was an 1800, late 1800s house, too, up in Putnam. I'll show you a picture uh, you know anything about what's going on down here at the end of Grandview? Because answers? With the end of the street? Over here? Yeah. What well, they're doing? Houses. Oh, three of them. Three of them, is that it? Yeah. The price it goes right around, too. <laughs> wow! That's a tiny what stance! Is wrong with him? That's a tiny stance and tall! What? Oh, it looks like I'd buy that if it was better shape. You, you say it's not in good shape, though? No, it's fucking... Did, he said upstairs on the third floor, there's fucking leaking from... Oh, it's he's, just too fucking big. He's got a lot... It's leaking? Fucking, he's got roof problems right there. Oh, yeah. Jesus. He said, no, they told me it was leaking from before they put the roof on. I said, yeah, of course they're going to tell you that. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yep. So I got to go up and take a look. Try uh. to talk them out of it. <laughs> All right, man. Well, between you and uh, the Frog Rock there, uh, have a nice trip. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm supposed to rain this weekend. We're supposed to have a thing for Camp Winnebog. I don't know if we're going to be on. Mm. Yeah, I'm just going to sit back and enjoy as usual. I might do nothing like Well, Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday, I don't do much. No, Monday through Sunday, I don't do much. I mow lawns when I have yeah. to. When I get that done, I work around the house a little bit, but... I've been enjoying not painting anymore. I've had it. Yeah, so is that what you're doing? Is uh, mostly the frog rock during yeah, the end of the weekend? Oh, that's all you're you know, doing now? You know, and when oh. it's over in September, that's it. I'm done. So you're retired then? Yeah. I'm not going to do nothing this winter. People have already called me. I said, nope, I'm done. No more painting. Good for you. You Barry had three houses for me inside to do it. I said, nope. Hmm. Lisa going back to work in the fall, does she know? Or, or is she out or is she going back and forth? She's working at the, uh, at the cafeteria doing something like that. Oh, okay. Or like feeding what. somebody anyway. They, they're doing something for the meals they're passing. Yeah, yeah. Hmm. She doesn't know they're saying something about preschool that they might not have AIDS. So I don't know. You know how the hell are you going to keep the fucking kids in preschool? You know what I mean? You think they're going to wear fucking masks? There ain't no goddamn way. Tie a, tie a net over there. Jesus. Tie a net over there or something. <laughs> you know, and the biggest thing with freaking the little kids is supposed to be teaching them to share. Right it's now, right you, can't, there, you, you know, got to stay away from me. You can't yeah. care nothing. You can't, this is you know what the world's mean? coming to, isn't it? Yeah. I, I've, I've noticed a lot on these... Uh, 
protests and stuff. There's reporters that talk to these kids. And these kids say, well, I have this idea. And this guy over here that's protesting for the same thing, he says, well, I have this idea. Every idea is different, but they all coagulate to say, yeah, fuck that guy. You know, that kind of shit. They make trouble. And what gets me with this Minneapolis thing is all the cops were walking around by the protesters so they didn't cause hate and discontent. What's behind them? The stores are getting busted into and oh, looted. God, yeah. Oh, yeah. And also, did you see the bricks that they had set in downtown? No. They had pallets of bricks put in. And the guys come along because their kids got knives and yeah. caught them, take bricks, toss them. The cops did it. You see the cops dropping them off right downtown. What a mess. This with the, along with the coronavirus. Is, uh, oh, yeah. Oh, now they're changing the fucking army bases from the uh, Confederate general. Well, I said, what is the big fucking I said, I said the other day when they started, they took Andrew Weimer off the fucking shelf. Yeah! Said, what are they going to do, take the fucking black fucking crayon out of the crayon? Yeah! <laughs> yeah. There you go. <laughs> Unbelievable. It's all in what you say nowadays. And uh, no matter what Trump treat, t- tweets, whether good, bad, or indifferent, the guy's a chump, but at the same time, but at the same time, everybody's digging on him for oh saying yeah. something. For oh saying yeah. something half oh the yeah. time. If you were up there on that podium and you were the president, hey, I think this, I think this, and this should be this, and this should be this. Oh, there's going to be somebody in the audience that oh says, boo. Oh yeah. oh yeah. But it's so fucked up. <laughs> yeah. 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 I'm too old to worry about it right now. No. We didn't see anything for this virus. A mask if you got to go anywhere. No, I didn't know. Luckily, and that's why I opened up the road. Yeah, I think, yeah, I knew it. It's funny though, when I looked at it, it was like, it had like 24 cases. And all of a sudden, when they didn't leave, it fucking jacked up to 132. Whoa, man. Yeah. Yeah. In Brooklyn down here? I get that. Yeah. Whoa! 45% <laughs> of them got it. <laughs> oh, sure and stay away from jail. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's something else. Oh, yeah. All right, Joe, catch you later, man. <laughs> uh, that was wicked cool. <laughs> no metal. Oh, must be off. Oh, I did turn it off just to talk to Joe.